Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm King Posh and today we're looking at my King All-Wheel Drive Drift Tune for this 1930 Bentley Blower 4.5 liter supercharged. Here is the share code. Got it? Great. And what is crazy about this car, I had to Google like how big the engine was because I'm thinking all it has like, you know, stock probably has like an inline, uh, you know, six or an eight, maybe a V12, maybe a V16. No, I'm looking at it right now and it's saying it was the engine was a 4.3, you know, CC four cylinder engine. And it had a supercharger with a boost of up to 11%. So, it was a four-cylinder. Who knew? Uh, I thought it had, you know, something, you know, bigger. Um, but it is what it is. Um, so, yeah. Anyways, mine's got a V12 in it. <laughs> so, there's that. All right. So, we went from 175 horsepower is what you got from the four-cylinder up to 1,515 horsepower. Now, this is an old tune. Um, this is more for my record, uh, but I wanted to share the uh, tune with you as well. Uh, it's all-wheel drive, and it's got a twin turbo. Now, like I said, this is an older tune. It's from 2022, so it doesn't have the parts like um, all the updates that have happened since then. Front bumper is completely stuck because, honestly, who needs a cow catcher? All right, doesn't need a cow catcher in the front there, um, and it definitely doesn't need that little spoiler back there that wouldn't do anything anyways with the, you know, the roof down. Um, so that the convertible top, we can call it, um, does have, you know, some nice, beautiful leather straps on, on top of the, uh, you know, the hood there. Uh, I am using the vintage white wall tire compound looks really nice on the car um i need a new controller i, I had the wed sport tc 105 and rims on there and they still look good versus you know you, you know the originals but um they still look good on there all right we got a six speed transmission hand on all that power race drive line and a drift differential can you tell my my controller is going Yes, it needs replaced. All right, we got race brakes. Oh yeah, no, oh, there's the uh, top of the car. All right, we've got drift springs and dampeners. Race anti-roll bars for the front and rear. No roll cage. All right, here, I'm gonna press down. Weight reduction, there is none, but you can make this into an S1 821 and save 922 pounds it's impressive but this is a 1515 horsepower a class beast all right and of course everything here is race all the way through um like i said it, this tune is from 2022 so guess what it's just got the race twin turbo not the one with the uh anti-lag and it doesn't need it to be honest and then it's got the race intercooler now the car mastery for this thing, as you can tell, I went through the whole thing and got my super wheel spin and then I, I added that in there as well and I still have yet to touch it. <laughs> so um, there's that. Now let's look at my tune back in 2022. Okay, 1515 looks like. All right, here is the gearing. Doesn't have to go all the way to the very end. Here is my alignment back in 2022. Okay. Anti-row bars are 810 and for some reason 65.00. But hey, if if the shoe fits, wear it. If it works, I don't care. Alright, springs are 955 and 936. Lowest and go is 6161. Dampening is 65, so it looks like all the way down. Alright, no downforce. Brakes are at 70% to the front with 130% pressure. And then we got 76, 46, 97, 97, and 71% of the power is going to the rear wheels. 
not too bad of an old tune from 2022. Um, you know, but like I said, if it works, it works, you know. So let's take out this, you know, Bentley blower and uh, see what it does. Seems to be smooth. Oh, it's like butter. It's super slidey. Love it. There's no problem going sideways. Oh, yeah. Up the hill it goes. This is sweet. I don't know why I didn't make a video of it back in the day. Yeah, there's a 43.3 right there. That's not too bad. Engine seems to be peppy. Chitty Chitty Bang Bang would be proud. Since that's what it's painted like. But yeah, it's a, it's a pretty sweet ride. I wouldn't change anything. Oh, it looks great. What do you think? Well, hey guys, I enjoyed making this video for you. If you enjoyed it as well, please like this video. Is there anything I can do to this thing? Well, I can turn off the lights. I can't get into there. I'd, I, I, I'd wonder if I can even get into the stock one. Uh, we can try um, for sure. Why not? I mean, it's not going to hurt. Um, we can open up the, the door and look inside. You know, that's pretty nice. Let's do that. Let's uh let's see if I can't get into the actual engine. I don't know. I haven't looked at this since 2022, you know. So, let's just do that. It's not going to hurt me. I have the tune saved. All right, this is what it looks like completely stocked. All right. Hey, we can look in there. Oh yeah, look at that. Huh, it definitely looks like, you know, four cylinder for sure. Yeah, it's, it's, that's wild looking. That's a small engine. I, I was expecting more. So yeah, crazy. Pretty cool, pretty wild. Anyways, huh. I'd be surprised. What? What's? What is that? Oh, okay. It's just. Uh, okay. Interesting. Wild. And it goes from a D class two hundred seven. What's the? Uh, yeah. What's the uh, speed on this thing? A hundred and three miles per hour. Back in nineteen thirty, that was that was pretty. That'd be pretty good. That's what I would think. Um, you know. But yeah. Cool. All right, what a change from from the uh, the original to uh, mine. Uh, it, it is a you know the the weight's not much of a difference, but everything else is. That's for sure. If you didn't read that. Just said second, third gear points tuned. Yeah, it's gonna cost me money. I just took it off. Of Whatever. Story of my life. Always wanting money. Don't know why. It is what it is. Oh well. Well, hey guys. Thanks for watching. And I'll catch you guys next time. Stay sideways, my friends.